Plants and Answers Flower Shop has had to cut hours because they can't afford to pay staff for the full day. They say canceled events are keeping them from making any real money. The staff that I had, she's been with me 18 years. I mean, you know, they become part of your family after a while. When you have to tell them to go home that you can't afford to pay me anymore, it breaks your heart almost. Clark Gooden's and, uh, Corner Flower Shop has been in business downtown Greensboro for more than 40 years. He never thought his business would take a hit like this. I still have three other employees that are no longer working, and I'm not sure when I'll have them back because of the special events paid for their salaries. Flower deliveries aren't enough. With no new events on the books, Gooden is doing what he can to stay afloat. I've been relying on people's birthdays, hospital visits, and unfortunately sympathy work to... Uh, you know, to keep the place going. It's a different story at Randy McManus Flower Shop on Battleground. Business has been great. Daniel uh, Stoner says social media and flexibility has been essential in keeping busy during the pandemic. We have um, have more events that we're doing, even though they're smaller. So large weddings have been broken down into um, smaller events. With more folks working at home, their at-home services has given them a boost. They want their environment to look nice. They've been at home so much. They want fresh flowers, fresh plants, and that's been huge. Stoner says canceled events put a damper on their business too, but he encourages other shops to be patient and wait for new buds to grow. Gooden says business has improved since being down 80% in May. He's hopeful folks will gather again and business will pick up.